My name is Ed Overbay. I'm the owner of Overbay Houseworks LLC. I've been in business since 1974, where I opened up my wood shop. Furniture is my first love, to be honest, and I try to carry that passion into woodwork into residential homes. So the farmers, the Russ and Sue, came to me to talk about a custom home they wanted to build. This was property that was his mother's. He grew up just down the corner from here. His original ambition was to build a relatively small, light on the maintenance end sort of a home. And he, he turned to Jeffrey Miller, who designed the home. And then the farmers and myself worked the house over and made a lot of changes, taking a meaningful departure from the original design to fit it into more of the farmer's sensibilities. Entry doors are one of my signature elements. Uh, every house I've built, every significant remodel I've done, uh, one of my caveats is that I will build the entry door. And so I built this entry door. Now this, this door is uh, somewhat of a challenge in its exposure. It's facing south, and so it gets all of the wind, it gets all of the, uh, the rain, it gets all of the sun. But an entry door is, is, is a visitor's first encounter to a house. So I enjoyed building this door a lot. And then we all kind of got into it. And Russ took the extra step to commission a very special bronze handle set for it. So it came out quite unique. So I'm really actually very proud of it. Well, it's an interesting house in that uh, it lives big, but it isn't actually big. It's, it's not as big a house as it seems, the perspective from the street is it seems imposing, it seems larger than it actually is, but it's actually a, a wonderfully scaled house. It's scaled wonderfully for a small family, enough space. What's also wonderful about it is the light. Uh, Jeffrey Miller did a great job in distributing light, and this is not something that many people actually understand how to do effectively in the Northwest, but this house embodies those skills. When you have light from three sides in a space where you spend a lot of time, like here in the living room, You've got, you've got a winner. Uh, the windows in this house, I, I think, are one of the best set of windows that Bergerson Windows ever put out. So the space, the flow, the house is just a very livable house. Good afternoon, I'm Chuck Bergerson, and uh, we started Bergerson Cedar Window in Fort Stevens, Oregon. So we started the window business because we saw windows that were over 100 years old were still good. Well, what's the difference? Part of it was the paint that was originally put on them, what protected them. But the most important thing was the western red cedar, old growth. You could take second growth and it didn't make much difference between cedar or fir. So that's primarily, I guess that's why we called it Cedar Window. And since I'm Norwegian descent, we wanted to put our name in there so we could sign them. So that, that made us want to make sure we build a good product. My name is Mike Abrams, Ava Company. Uh, I've been a homeboy here for 62 years. We placed all these rocks and we um, did all the dig out here and they said we were only going to take 50 cubic yards and we took out about 3,500 cubic yards. It was a challenge. And they wanted uh, six rocks originally. Next thing you know, uh, six rocks, I want some more. And then there ended up being 651. The owner wanted it to be like a jetty so people wouldn't come up from the street and the road. And so we made it look like a jetty down there. The people that built this house were the best of the best, all locals, that all are very, very talented. What I try to foster in my builds is I want, to, I want everybody's A game. I want everybody to come up and step up with the best that they've got and, and look back at something we can all be proud of because at the end of the day, that's, that's what you got left.